Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to another video. Today, we'll be playing this game called uh, Episode. Well, it's this app that has like various storylines you can go through. It has interesting plot lines. Um, according to a friend, <laughs> um, it's kind of like Love Island, the game that Cody and Noel would play on their YouTube channel back in the day. I'm not sure if anyone remembers, <laughs> but hold on. As of my other videos, I am also eating in this one. Alright, so let's cut to the chase. Um, so the video is probably going to be vertical, because I don't know how to how else to edit it. Um, I've tried about, I have tried other al alter- I have tried other alternatives, but yeah, let's get started. Um, it's already 8 or 9 p.m. Let's, let's get a move on. I- I have an essay I need to write. Park. Alright, so basically I've played like one or two episodes already of the, of the plot. Essentially, so the main character's name is Tarek. I'm playing as this um, character, and she is participating in a dating show. And the love interest I chose is Maverick. He's like an all-around nice guy. Um, so, like, he remembers what uh, Tarek's coffee, favorite coffee is. Um, cooks for her. Decided to sleep on the couch um, instead of in the bed with her. Yeah, we'll see where this goes. Oh, yeah, there's, like, this plot. Like... Uncertainty, yes. Where it's like, is he like a player or is he not? Alright, we'll see. Alright, let's start stream recording. Okay. What would I like to drink? Um. Sorry, guys. Yeah, give me a non-alcoholic drink. I'm not old enough yet. Pineapple juice seems swell. Mostly because I don't know what the other options are. Dude, you know what I like about Maverick? Every time Tari says like what she wants, Maverick's like, I'll remember. That's kind of funny, because I kind of do that sometimes. Oh no, the wave of race fucking back. You laugh and ask each other questions while you eat your food. Now the most romantic first date, but definitely more fun than you expected. I mean, honestly, like if you just eat food on like a first date, that's kind of like a that's like a pretty good first date. Like food is a W all oh, anytime. You get back to your bedroom, he closes the door, smiles at you. What do you think about I was just wait, I, I think I'll do what like Cody and Noel do. They like switch their voices, I guess. Like they make Noel's British accents are so good. I was just thinking about Oh, this is so bad. Uh please don't please don't flame me guys. I was just thinking about how even if this wasn't the first remote I can't no Romantic first date. I still- I'm still glad I got to spend it with you. Oh no. Uh, I can't- can't do a British one. I think I'm gonna have to do an Australian one. I was just thinking- I'm sorry y'all. And usually on a first date, there could be an opportunity for- for a first kiss. We didn't get to do the kiss of the life on the beach. Your heart starts to beat a little faster as he places his hand on your waist. Bold move, Maverick. Bold. True to your name. Although a life-saving kiss isn't exact although a life-saving kiss isn't exactly how I would imagine a first kiss to be. I just can't on her can't on her cheek, bro. He is big of this. I just think that something like this I'm sorry you guys, you guys might find this annoying. Is a lot more romantic for a first kiss. Something I'm not gonna do like a voice for Tariq. <clears throat> Excuse me, just because, um, 
I don't think I can. <laughs> Something like that. He, he tilts his chin up, cupping your face in his hand as he brushes his lips against yours. Hey, this is my problem with the game. First option, 29 gems. Kiss him back. Second option, 19 gems. Kiss his cheek. Wait, they force you to pick an option. Oh, excuse me. I'm really tired. We should probably get some sleep. You're right. Sorry for keeping you. Sorry for keeping you up. No, is Beth? I think Beth's like the the friend. I think Romana is like an op for sure. Yeah, I'm a little nervous, low key. Oh, this guy Maverick, bro. And the possibility that today could be the last day I get to see you. I don't think we're gonna get limited. I hope not. Because I really feel like we missed out on Paris. There's just so much I want to explore with you. This feels so right to me. This is why I came on the show. To meet someone like you. I'm not ready to go... I'm not ready to let go of that yet. I am not going down without a fight. <laughs> this guy is crazy, bro. Am I afraid of being eliminated? 100%. 100%. I just hope Tark knows how much this time together has meant to me. Do you think Maverick is a player? You know, if he turns out to be a player, I'd be super surprised. Eh, what I know? Like, he's a nice guy. I feel like... I don't know. I haven't really. I don't really know. I can only speak for myself. And uh, in terms of being a player, um, do you think Maverick is a player? Um, no, I don't think so. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to our first elimination. That's right, it's time to remove one of these pesky players. Ladies, we will ask you at one time to vote. Yeah, I have a reading impediment. On which guy you think is a player? The guy who receives the most votes will be sent home. It's time to vote. Alright, yeah, let's see who I'm gonna vote. Romeo likes, like, look at that chiseled jawline. Wait, does everyone have that chiseled jawline? Jeez. Oh, wow. Keith with his curly hair, I feel like he'd be like a player for sure. <sighs> Actually, Elfie with his smile, I feel like he's like definitely got like. Yeah, I don't think Miles is. Colt. Oh, he's wearing the hat backwards too. Uh, I don't know, Alfie is gonna be like vibes. I'm gonna pick Alfie. What final secret? Secret. The three boys who aren't players are millionaires? Wait, if Maverick is a millionaire. Please don't send my boy Maverick home. Read two more chapters to receive a new story. Hallelujah, bro. Alright. Alright, let's see. Please don't say Maverick. Elfie's out, let's go! <laughs> Imagine Elf. I think, alright, I think Elfie's probably the millionaire just because he's dressed really nicely. Um, but money's not everything, it's fine. And I think Maverick's a millionaire anyway, so if, as long as he in, he's in, I think we're good. I think he is a millionaire for sure.
I knew he's a millionaire. It's fine. I mean. <sighs> alright, Alfie is. Alright, so the smile was a nervous smile. Alright, it's fine. We're fine. I don't hate the player, bro. How do I feel about possibly sharing my bill with a millionaire? I'm really very much okay with it. <laughs> oh, Ramona is... Ramona? Ramona. She's... We need her out ASAP. Time to play these players. Time to play the players. I'm not walking out here with some bro. It's loser. Man. I'm sort of bummed to be voted off last time my partner, but I still had a great time doing the show. I'm really rooting for Tarkin Maverick. I think he's legit. That's what I'm saying. You say tense? I'm not tense. I just have a lot of questions for you. I'm not surprised. Honestly, I'm super glad they reviewed the situation. Which is your. Which. Sorry, speech impediment. Which situation? The fact that you're a player? The fact that I'm a millionaire? The bro just drops it out. Like, what is going on? Also, I'm not surprised, because, you know, like, he gave off millionaire vibes. Like, he's super chill. Well, he, he wasn't, like, a, he didn't give off player vibes, so by default, he's a millionaire, is what I'm trying to say. I've hated keep I've hated keeping it a secret. They made me sign a waiver when I joined the show. I had to agree that it would be revealed at the right moment. Honestly, I didn't mind it at first, because I was looking for real love, not someone who only sees money. But then when they dropped the whole player secret, I felt this wedge between I'm so bad at reading. I knew there was something I was keeping from you, and I didn't want you to think it was because I'm playing you. He's a nice guy, bro. Wait, what if what if he's playing like 5D chess and is actually playing Tarek? Alright. So you're not a player? I swear to you. I'm here as a genuine contestant, looking for love, it's old. And I honestly can't believe my luck that you chose me out of all those guys. Now everything is out in the open. We can get to know one another without any inhibitions. And I have an idea. An idea? Yeah. Did you see they left us this game on the side of the bed? No, I didn't. Yeah, it's like a card game for couples. I know we're not technically a couple yet, but you did a couple up. You did couple up with me. I did. So why don't we get to know one another as a couple? You go first and ask me one of the cards. I'm sorry, I'm just laughing because of my voice. It's so bad. He's so excited to play with me, and I want to get him to know him better, to make sure his intentions are true, I'll... What? Tell his game is stupid and good with sleep is the only option I can choose? No, I'm tired, I think I'll just go to sleep. Okay, sure. Damn, they're in bed already? Alright, alright, not right. I know he was super toy last night, but I'm hoping today we can maybe spend some more time together. Get to know one another a little bit better. Sure, sounds good. Honestly, I feel like the more I get to know you, the more I like you. That's... Is that a classic line? I don't know. What do I even say here? Like, you're very sweet. I think he's really sweet. I know they're gonna make us pick new partners again this week. Do you think you'll pick me again? I'll definitely pick him again, but I'll try- I'll just say wait and see. Keep him on the edge. Time will tell. Am I confident that Tark believes I'm not a player? Oh, wait, maybe he is a player. Maybe he's playing 5D chess. I'm not taking anything for granted at this point. And I don't think I could ever take her for granted. She's something else. Good morning. Good morning. How did you sleep? Fine, you? I slept awfully. 
I can't believe they sent Kara home last night because she partnered with Alfie. Yeah, that was a twist I didn't see coming. Also, we were the ones who voted her out, but... Bless you. What are we supposed... Bless you. What are we supposed to do now? I don't think it makes much difference. We still want to avoid coupling with players. It just gives us an incentive to work harder in the challenges so we can couple up genuine guys. How are we supposed to know who is genuine and who isn't? I guess we just need to take a take every opportunity we get to find out more about our guys. How do you suggest we do that? Talking, hanging out, getting close to one another. How close are you getting to Maverick? Definitely getting to know him a lot better, but there's a long way to go. Do you get any player vibes from him? No, not at all. He's really genuine with me. He's legit. That's what they all say. Nah, I think he's legit though, for sure. I wouldn't say that too loud or Ramona will swoop in. Ramona's kind of nah, she's an off. I don't think if she I don't care what she hears. What's she going to do? What's going what's who going to do? Speak of the devil. Nothing, we're talking about the recoupling ceremony. You mean desperately clinging onto someone who doesn't want you? Just because your your partner isn't into you. Whatever. Well, Just want to make sure that it doesn't rhyme. Do I have any friends in the villa? No. But who needs friends when you're trying to marry a millionaire? Hoi. Hoi. Sorry, I'm trying to say it. Hey, oi. Oi, I got your black coffee. Thank you. You ladies are whispering over there. Target was just telling us who she wants to partner up with next. Oh, was she? Yeah, she said she's getting kind of bored with you. Don't worry though, my bed will be free. Maverick looks crushed. I can't let Ramona lie to him like this and manipulate the situation. I need to. What? The only option I can choose is to agree with Ramona and humiliate Maverick? I'm here to meet new people and explore my connections. Like I said, she's fickle. Don't worry, Maverick. I'm looking to upgrade my partner. I mean, partnering with her would be a downgrade, but maybe we just maybe we just wait and see what happens with the recoupling. Good morning, couples. I don't know what you. I don't know about you guys, but after all the drama last night, I'm all exhausted. But unfortunately, there's no time to rest while you're trying to meet the love of your life. Our recoupling ceremony will be taking place tomorrow. Okay, I'm just gonna skip over these. Um. Uh, I didn't mean to skip over my boy Lapras lines, actually. Come and see me before. I'll meet you in my dressing room and give you a private fashion show. Ooh, okay, Tariq, okay. Deal. Hey, lovers, let's get going. We're missing limos. Alright. Alright, so we got color yellow. These dresses all look the same. No, I actually think this one looks pretty nice. Wow, yellow looks gorgeous on you. Thank you. You look pretty. You clean up pretty good yourself. No, nah, my boy, I just dripped out. They've got us all in the same suit. I feel like a clone. A sixth. A sexy clone. I had something to, I had something to give you. What's that? A good look kiss. Nah, this guy is crazy. What? This guy is crazy. He's making the moves. Alright, let's see what happens. What are you waiting for? Nah, Tarek. He grins as his eyes dart over to your body. Before you grasp your hips and flips you, flips you around, pressing against the closet. He's doing like the classic, like, hand on the wall type beat. I was waiting for you to tell me you want it. <laughs> now, this game is so wild. She makes it seem like. That she wants to kiss, and the game's only option that's like not pay pay to play is get your hands off me, which is fair, you know. Consent is important. Um, stop it! Not here. Sorry. 
I've got to go to the green room. And go look out there. Oh wow, you look so cute. That's like a goat. I think she's a W friend, for sure. Okay, that's stunning. Uh, best nervous, alright, it's fine. Why would I be jealous of someone with a stained dress? Ramona says. What? Whoops! Ramona? Dang, I actually like this dress too. What do I do? Four minutes, let's get ready, ladies. Quick, run back to Silas. <laughs> Excuse me. See if he can do anything. I swear to God, if I had another if I had another glass of wine, I would have thrown it all over Ramona. You know, Beth is my guy. She's like she's my G. Victoria, Ramona's just totally out of control this point. <laughs> she's a wild animal. What happened? What happened to you? Ramona happened. She threw her drink on me. Are you serious? But you have the red carpet. You know, I was hoping Aurelia was back here somewhere to help me clean it. Quick, come this way. We'll find her together. He takes her hand in before dashing off back to the dressing rooms. Aurelia, are you there? It's an emergency. I'm here. I was just sorting out a new collection that came in. Oh my lord, what happened to you? Ramona is jealous of Tarek. Ramona is jealous. Sorry. Ramona is jealous of Tarek. She just threw a drink at her. A full glass of wine. Red wine? That dress is silk. This is sacrilege. Can you fix it? You must have something. Club soda white vinegar to remove the stain. Are you serious? Your club on the stage is in two minutes. The only thing I can do is. Yes! Quickly, you can change into one of my new dresses. New dresses? Look. Ooh, bold is crazy, bro. They go low by sabotaging your dress, or you go high by dazzling them in an even better dress. Aurelia is a W, stylist for sure. Ramona will split, split boy, when she sees you in one of these dresses. That's wild. Quick, try them on. Hmm. Those one has got the most claws for sure. Wow, you look absolutely incredible. She'll be the queen of the red carpet in that dress. There's no way I can let Ramona ruin my dress and take first place. I have to stay stained? What? Nah, okay, this this story is so stupid. Wow. Alright, I'm just gonna speed run through this because I feel like it's kind of stupid. Just. Oh, what is going on? Because, like, the game forces you to make decisions that's, like, stupid. Ramona needs to get out of here, bro. Drop like tot. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> oh, that's what that means? What it means? How does this be fun though? Flip your hair for sure. The style. One more Tarek? Alright. Yeah, let's just do it for the camera, Locus. You didn't look so smug. Walking the red pop walking the red carpet in a sticky stained gown. How the mighty have fallen. You better watch your back, girls. Oh, girls, we need a group shot. It's for Rossi. This, this isn't over. Choose your place with fun red carpet. Let's just um, wink. Good evening. Okay. Okay, recoupling. I got through another episode, I think. Alright, just need one more story. One more episode, alright. 
I'm out of passes. All right, I guess that's a good place to end the story. Oh, so maybe the reason why my story wasn't saved is because I didn't have an account. Please let me sign in. Cool. All right. With that being said, I hope everyone enjoyed the video. Um. Yeah. I don't really know what's up. But yeah, I'm gonna cut this and then maybe uh, look an outro.